All right, it's a rainy day in the greenhouse here, or a rainy day outside, I should say. And uh, wanted to show you the video of the completed greenhouse uh, that the blog had an entry on earlier. Uh, we didn't go with above ground beds here because we actually had really good dirt. Uh, and so what we did is we tilled it up down to about 24, 26 inches deep. And uh, this has become the pepper house and a tomato house. Got peppers down both sides. These peppers are in the ground and well established. Several different breeds. This barrel here is a currently a work table. Uh, and then what we have is uh, tomatoes. Uh, these tomatoes obviously grow up and we'll have uh, string for them to, to hang on to. Up. Got a, a, a vent back there that we're going to mount a fan in uh, here shortly with the original plan. But now we're going to take and uh, drop out that framing and we're going to extend this greenhouse out, out 40 more feet um, and put the fan down there instead of uh, establishing another greenhouse elsewhere uh, if you look through that window way down there you'll see the corner post of the uh, goat pasture pen that we recently put up uh, but this this should harvest us a lot of uh, tomatoes here uh, and they've sprouted and come up real good and they're, and they're very well established in here uh, Greenhouse 3 was going to be put up today, but uh, as I'm fairly sure you can hear on the video, uh, the rain is steady enough that's not going to be a good option. All right, so we're going to go over and take a look at uh, Greenhouse 1, what we got going on over there, and uh, be right back with you.